so many questions. Look how menacing he looks. He's. I think he's gotten <laughs> more muscle. He runs every morning, Joel. Is that you might catch her with that type of uh, clothing. Son of a bitch. Oh no. <laughs> oh dear. We have awoken the beast. Ga 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 ga. That's what we're hearing from in there. Why are you making noises with your? Oh. It's a. A fight to end all fights. Ow! Oh, my head! <laughs> What's all this? You're alright, Mr. Winright. I just need I to ask you a quick question. Builder. Come in there and just kick me in the ass outside of my own guild. You know what? I'll go tell him off. Yes, it's I'll be right back. <laughs> oh, shit. I. <laughs> It's it's locked. Doors are locked. I can't I can't get in there. <laughs> All right. What 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 do you want? Marcus is in the merchant. Uh, do you have a small gemstone? One that might fit in the inside of a ring. A small gemstone. Uh, preferably blue or green. Me. Oh God. Oh, there we go. All right. We have a flame. Blue gold, egg. So haggling. Let's open the shop and see what we go. <coughs> Pack well, tactics, roll with advantage, man. You're stuck opening the shop for all time, so if you just have something, we can briefly grab it. Now, let's see. <coughs> Where's the big one? This accursed thing of a neighbor, good lord. Oh, I'll have to wake up smelling cheese and salami. What happened? No robes. Where's my candle? Where is the cheese going? Okay. Uh oh. oh that's it's alright. Right. I'm lost without my goddamn <laughs> job. <laughs> it looks so barren. <laughs> Just check <laughs> the back real quick and see if you've got any. I'll take your entire <laughs> star. <laughs> alright, let me let me go look. Let me see what we have in. <laughs> Do you keep your stuff in the Alright. That's it. That's mine. Keeps it tax free. <laughs> Did you know there's a secret compartment? <clears throat> Wayne Wright walks up to the wall and presses the stones in a certain way. What? Hey, that's mine! <laughs> I just broke into someone's house. Alright. I don't know what all that business was. Okay, you want a small gemstone? Yes. Sapphire or emerald. Um. Small yeah, enough to right. fit in the inside of a ring. Yeah, you remember you were there. Yeah. All right. Let me see. Let me see what we can do for you. I don't think small precious gemstone is a commodity item. <laughs> small gemstone. Yeah, sometimes they're very hard to come. You okay, son? Yeah, I'm fine. No one does. Oh. My knees been standing around all morning. You have that under control now? Ah, <sighs> likewise. Except for when I was sitting down over there. Here comes a time. God, the, the boy. Hello, boy. Hello, boy. Ah! <laughs> Where's your hat? Where's your hat? Uh, I bet one of the other cats stole it from him. Thieves, all of them. Let me see here. Alright. Well, I guess all my goods are in here. Let's see what we got. Um. I... You just see Wayne right opening compartments on a tree. Well. <laughs> It's fancy. <laughs> no. oh, oh, that's the expensive <laughs> stuff. <laughs> What's your budget it's so like? so cute. Like, but it's just so casual. And I think <clears> What's the budget? There you go. Shoot, I don't know. <clears throat> Something not, not nice, a cut gem. Not the smallest. I don't know. That much. Something nice. Nothing gaudy. Mm. What's this for, Vesrum? Practical, but beautiful. What's it for? Yeah. More armor, I feel like you look like a oh, that's a bed. <laughs> so, so here's, here's I have a, a, a an old no necklace reason. or something. There's a little. I don't know if it'd fit on a, on a ring, but if you wanted to purchase it. No, no. 
Rain Ray, you peeing in the bushes. Oh my god. Now? Get the tune. You know there's a bylaw against that. Yeah, I, I get the... Also, it's keep so it on the hush hush, just in case. It's like a law, but like, sure. you just get fined you know if you don't... Of, uh, you the bylaws of, uh... Like, hey, what was that tune you were talking about again? A couple of them. One of them's no peeing in public. <clears throat> Pissing you by yourself, handsome. Yeah, I hate you. Really? <laughs> oh, here we go. Pulls out a full briefcase. <clears throat> Look at this. You would see in front it's of you, nice <laughs> Mirren and the rest of you, uh, a wide selection of gemstones. Oh. Oh. Take your, take your rope, take your pick. It's not the shiny thing, so I'm afraid I haven't got much of an eye for uh, all the, what the finer ones are and whatnot. But, uh, like well, that's to, why um, you have Mr. You? Morgo here for you. I'm sure you you've got plenty of gem. You see this one? Uh, no, you see the small imperfection there. Mm. Oh. Mm. Imperfections are what make see. gemstones really good. No, that's the I'm complete opposite. That one. Unless you, I don't know, grow one yourself. <clears throat> How are you supposed you to grow, grow a gemstone? We live with, in interesting with gem times. seeds. I've heard we stories of it. Idiot. What's... Gem seeds. <laughs> <laughs> Go find me a gem seed, <laughs> smartass. <laughs> <laughs> Rain right, I'd like to purchase a gem seed. You'd like a gem seed? How much money you got? How many gem seeds have you got? I've got the one, but I've got a price in my head. Alright, we'll say your price. You're a no, fucking merchant. No, 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 no. You give me an offer. Mm. Come on. Rain right, is this up to code, buddy? I'd hate to get the council on your ass. <laughs> Listen here. Here we go. Little lordling, like alright? This is an emporium. <laughs> the sapphire. You don't know what you're dealing in. I implore you to get this up to code. Shape? Just imagine some, yeah. a move. I forget what they called the cut. I got more money than your entire <laughs> estate and anything you'll ever own. Hmm. Weird flex, but okay. How much that for one? one? That one's really nice. It's just a silver. It's this small. Oh, really? Just a silver? Yeah, it's a small it's one. If you want to go <laughs> bigger, that, right? <laughs> if you want to go bigger, what do you call it? Carrots, that's weight. What do you want to go bigger? Diamond well, weapons, but using yeah. so imagine, Ooh, like you're that starting one. now to trust this mm. Wainwright guy. The He's measuring gemstones and carrots. This one here... Why would you measure gems? How many carrots a thing is? Yeah, why would you measure it in fucking vegetables? How stupid. It's alright. Not, not spelled the same. That's about the entirety of the budget that I have for the whole. It's a different word completely. Now if you want something really nice, I'll cover it. This one here. Is this another there, there, and there? He, he would show you a very pristine yeah. sapphire. About twice the size of the one you're currently holding. How many now carrots this, is in a carrot? This will get them to like you. None? <laughs> well, what the fuck? I don't know if he's that flashy. That thing's almost as big as a thumb. I'll be back. Hmm. Fair enough. Probably impractical for uh, back. <laughs> for three silver. <clears throat> All right, sure. Thank you. Hope it serves you well. Thank you so much, mate. Really. Of course. Consider it a gift. A uh, gift hey, for your. Okay. You know. <laughs> right. You know what? Thank you. Congratulations. Right. Oh well. None needed yet, but. It's hoping. Oh, thank you. <laughs> All right, sure. Right. Well, I suppose I'd better get back to the waiting room and uh, see if I can mm, get yes. in line for a, a five-minute yeah, chat. Off you go. Gemstones are forever, and sometimes elves. Take care. Right. Oh, and if you need any help uh, getting ready and all, um, I'll be available after. 
Just make sure you pack everything that you think you ever ever need. All right. I've never seen okay. an alpha liver gem though yet. Hmm. Thank you. Hmm. Well, you're free to go, Mr. Uh, Wainwright. Thank you for your help. No, no, I I'm here. I... Oh. <clears throat> well, <laughs> all right then. <laughs> you have any potions? I got goods for sale. Wainwright Emporium. Hmm. Potions. What are you looking for? Food. I'm looking what for healing potions? potions, really. And actually, if you have any night's eye potions, I know they're exceedingly rare. But if you have any climbing potions, well, any kind of potion, really. Let me see. Let me start opening up my compartments here. Um, Is that why the wall's so uh, thick? I kind of got blown off on this one. Absolutely. Do you need to talk to me still, or...? Any ropes, bombs? I do. Trinkets, yes. odds and odds, that sort of thing. Yes, exactly. Mm -hmm. I'm looking I to protect myself and to deal some damage. Healing potion and I don't claim to be the best <laughs> merchant. A major and two advanced. Absolutely. Right. Let me see if I can much find each? these bastard things. Alright. My god, it gets worse by the god's damn day. I think we found it, gentlemen. Turn and walk away. There it is. It's, it's always weird trying to find these. I'm sorry. I'll fill my own coffers. I say this because I was picking. You're not. This is a guard business. Right. You are the leader. Now the major now. one is going for ten silver, and the two advanced are going for. Wait, let me see. Morning. Eight silver each. It is definitely morning. Yes. Yeah. Doing okay? If you want to complain about the Still? price, there's the Imperial Terrorist. Mm. Store. I'm paying protection. Still morning? Would you do all no. Looks like it. <laughs> no. No. Need a hand something? Today's just been disappointing so far, I guess. So was yesterday and the day before that. I'm sorry. Keep running into dead ends. <clears throat> I would do. That's a bit far for me. I would do all of them for twenty-five. Can you meet me in the middle at twenty-four? Get in there! The fuck is going on? Let there be light. One good. Ah! What the hell will work with you? But you may want to pay attention to what they say. It may help with your what? problem. How many are you buying? Bishop wants to talk to me. So I don't know what this about. the hell are you talking about? What the hell? How much does he want for it? 24 in total. 24. I have brought him down from 26. I am not in the mood for this cryptic shit today. Yeah, that's the place where. Okay, so when I get pickpocketed. Bishop says I need to talk to you and then talks to Wainwright for 20 minutes. Is this 12? It's 12. <laughs> yep. Then allow me to make it a lot easier for you. Come with me. I need to speak with you later, but I was gonna drink it. It'll help you so you can get prepared. Come with me. Why would you drink your own stock? Oh, God, Listen, I like it for the taste. Okay? <clears throat> Keeps me sane. That's an expensive taste, my man. <laughs> All right, I'll leave you to your business. Only the finest. Take care. Oh my God. Oh, now he's done, Zane. You two drow. I require your ears. I don't have any. Wow, me. Oh, right. That explains a lot. What uh, potions did you, you get? Them nubs? This. Two advanced and a major. Mm. Um, if you or Marco come across uh, Night Stalker potions. Um, That's the hope, honestly. Well, apparently, Venora might have a way of replicating it. So, if we can get them to her, it'd be incredible. Exactly. God, Just something to keep an eye out for. Yeah. <coughs> uh, yes. Why is the damned? Oh, he locks it up now. That's so smart. Michael is a genius. Yeah, but Wait, you can. Put the bill hooks out in the open. Oh no, I'd hate for someone yeah. to steal that. Also, you can climb directly over it. 
Don't do it. I've tried already. I'll have to tell him about that. Ow, why is it fucking electrified? <laughs> Kidding. Welcome. <sighs> okay, so... Shriek. I hear you're already interested in going to Nithmerillion. <laughs> Me? <laughs> Nithma, huh? Nithmerillion? Underground, weren't you? You said you were going? <sighs> Which your father said? I'm debating whether or not I'm going down. Hmm. I won't force you. <clears throat> I have no choice, though. Seems that way with a lot of people. Apparently, we are down to the last possible time we can actually go down and get whatever this thing is that everyone's so interested in. Ooh. So your father has told me that in a day or two, he's going to muster up men on the surface of an entrance to the northeast. He's going to camp it out and make sure people don't come behind us. We're going to go down there and find what this thing is. And... Figure out what it does. See if we can use it. Well, what the people thing? that I have on my list... Honestly, others know more than I do at this point. Hopefully I can gather more information on the fly. But apparently there's something then down we're there. we're interested in two different things. Mm. What do you mean? Because we know what we're looking for. What is it? The Clearium. Ah, Star Metal, right. Mm. Well, if there is any Star Metal down there, that would be the place for it. Old city from the first era. It's going to take Arn so is long tasked... to everything. <laughs> Probably. Arn has tasked me with finding whatever is the source of this magical disturbance as of late, why everyone's having these weird dreams. Um, Wait. You should probably all know. Um, myself, Marco, and then um, oh gods, um, Venora all had a shared dream of Nithmerillion last night. It was um, some high lord, and he was assuaging this chancellor and this commander who were both uh, arguing and bickering over something to do with Silith. And, um... And they both stormed off. You too. From what I've heard, this potion seller man, he says that when there are magical disturbances, the, the stronger they get, the more it starts to affect those who are sensitive to it. For a long time I've been getting these sorts of visions, and then Wood Elves started to get it. It seems like you've been getting them for a while. It means if we don't deal with this, it's going to become an issue. So, it's now or never. I plan to go down there, if needed, <clears throat> seal it. If we can bring it back up, we we'll make it useful. We do that. Whatever seems right at the time. But we don't want it for the elves, or for the drow faction, or for anyone that isn't us, to get their hands on it. Because we don't know what they could do with it, and it might be the end of us. Sarah, if you're interested in coming, I'd extend the invite, but I want to make sure that that we're on the same page with this. I was going down there without you. So I guess <clears throat> going together is smart. There's a couple of groups of people that have their own reasons for going down there, apparently. You should definitely talk to everyone. I know Venora says that she has to go down there. I Tang wants to go down there. You need to go down there. You've been tasked to go down there. I've also been tasked with having a sort of assistant or second-in-command. 
Kyler, I'd like that to be you. If you come. <clears throat> I'll think on it. I don't think he should. Mm. I think he should stay on the surface with Olena and his father. Every single time we do this shit, someone suffers. I'll admit, <clears throat> personally, I don't want to go down there. It terrifies me. I don't want to die there and leave everything. And I know if I die, that's Arndon. He'll never be the same. He said it himself. I... I'm torn. My honor tells me to go down with you and protect you all and look after you, but... The bigger picture me and the selfish me... I have an alternative, though. Hmm. <clears throat> I would stay up with Arn, defend the opening, and after a certain set amount of time, or if a message can be sent, um, if you get into trouble, I can take a small retinue down with the express purpose of getting everyone out, if things go bad. Your father will need someone with eyes that can see in the dark in case the drow try to follow us in. <clears throat> Probably a good idea that you do stay on the surface. If I do and someone does die, I will... <laughs> I will blame myself. Let's be if honest someone dies down there, it's my fault. Because I failed to command them right. Let's get that straight. It's most likely going to happen. It always does. It's only 12, 12 of us going in. We don't know what we're going to fight. <clears throat> the best we can do is be ready. And... Despite our luck, it is likely someone will die. You cannot let you think that that is your fault. I'll stay up with Arn, and after, well, how big is Nif? How long, how long should it take, do you think, this excursion? <laughs> it could be days. The city might span the entire <clears throat> province for all we know. It does. The thing has said so. Weeks. It's a good thing I've been stacking in hardtack. Is there any Not way... enough for 12 people for at least six days, seven days. Is there any probably, way that... Um, by tomorrow I'll have more. You could communicate from down there to up the surface. A at all. Possibly. I might be able to get a message to Awen. <clears throat> but I don't know if he can hear me underground. I want... I, I'll stay up with Arn and if things get bad and if you can send a message or if you're not back within, I don't know, a couple of days, I can lead a retinue down myself purely to get everyone out if things go bad or if mistakes happen. If the worst happens, we'll send a runner up. Maybe two. Okay. That works. <clears throat> I would like to talk it over the people I have in mind. Those who are on the must go list right now are myself. Markle, as he is somehow involved in all of this, though his memory is sparse, for some reason the elves seek him, and the knowledge that he took a long time ago, 
whatever it is. There is Venora, Tang. There's also L. She has a vested interest in things that have been going on out there. Having a bit of a private conversation. Mind coming back later? Uh, sure. Uh, by any chance, have you seen the um, uh, for one of the forged blacksmiths uh, named Shriek? I have. I know Why? that you've talked with people. Um, my accomplice wants to speak with them. My know him, Herbaja. If I see him, I'll send him your way. Sounds good. I'll be at the tavern. Take care. Take care. Don't close the door. Let me go. Oh, okay. having a talk. Fine. Uh, where do I put? This? I can move it to my study uh, if you'd like. Ah, <clears throat> uh, oh, wait. Even better on the bill hook. What? What is that? It's a wanted poster. They don't want a description. Or everything. It's just for a man named Mr. Biggs. <sighs> so far, you said about five the people. Yes, um... <sighs> Who else? Cade has to go, he has ties to the Institute, and they might be able to help us figure out whatever this thing is. Um... Ellen Jensen. God. Then there was... Who the fuck else? There's... I, I'm a little confused here, right? So we know at least three entrances to this place. One of them we know where it is exactly. The other one I know the general area of. And the one we want to go to, we have no idea where it is? I know where it is. I know how to get there. I can take us there. It's a simple stretch to get there. <sighs> simple. We go to the border. We'll have Arn and his retinue with the lord of the province there. They will not aggress on us on our own land. We will take the road north, or we will find a side passage. We'll go until we find ruins, and then we will excavate them from there. That is where the entrance is. Right, it's also where the Persian sure. seller was trying to go. <clears throat> I've already forgotten half the list, but um, it was myself, Venora, Cade, L, Jensen, Tang, Markle. I was thinking Aegon for his blade, Torty because she can see in the dark, though I'm not sure if she wants to go. Um... Do you want to go? I don't know, I guess I'll go fuck myself. You've said everyone's name except mine. <laughs> I already said I was going to invite you. I don't I'm need your to think invite. Of the other... This isn't your mission. Yes, it is. I'm going I've down there for personal reasons. Oh, you too? Yes. Welcome to the club. Selveth, this doesn't need to be a difficult thing. But we do need to You're act as a difficult. cohesive unit. I've done nothing. You've taken a slight from me simply trying to recall the people I had said earlier. Did you have uh, a vision last night, a weird dream, where there was a bunch of people yelling at each other, a bunch of elves? Yes. Cool, so there's four now. Yes. We talked about it. <clears throat> so, the three of you are definitely going. That much is clear. Everyone has different reasons for going down there, but I think we can all agree it's smarter if you work together. It is, and I've been told to bring people that I can trust implicitly and I know will follow commands. Will that be a problem? How many times do I have to say it? I'm going down there with or without you. Not the answer I was looking for, Sarah. I have my own plans. Not everyone needs to work for you. 
Do you understand what I'm telling you? I shouldn't be around the others when we go down there. And that is final. You're going to get yourself killed. Oh no. Should I be scared? Inquiry. Why should you not be around anyone else? Does that have to do with your uh, other friends? No. I need to get my hands on a clerium. And then I need to take it somewhere where it can be forged. Hmm. And you need That's to think fine. They have some down there, how? It's a relic city from the age first era. It, if it's not that, I don't know where I will possibly find it. We don't know for sure, but it's our best bet, basically. It's my only way. Mm -hmm. Servith. I understand you don't want to, I don't know, take orders from me or whatever it is. <sighs> but I've been tasked with getting a group that. together. I am fine with us taking a detour or whatever it is to get this material. That's fine. My life is not a fucking detour. It's a secondary objective. <laughs> not your life, this material. <laughs> For you, maybe. That is the only reason I am going down there. And I am going down there with or without you. I am separating from the group and I am going for the metal. By myself or with people who will come with me. Sarah. I've already said it's a non-issue. But I need to know that we can work as a team, as a unit, as a functioning group. No splintering no, off, can't. no fighting while we're I in cannot. the dark. I cannot then, work around any of you. Then I am not bringing you. You want to know why, Vesrin? You don't tell me what to do. I'm going down there regardless, and if you fuck with me, you can tell I that will to make Arnold. it a problem for you. I mean, so the, because Arnold the is controlling the gate, is you're going down by yourself. That that's 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 all I'm hearing here. I haven't even you're been given time to plan for the reason that I am going down there, which Arnold has also tasked me with doing. Wow. Oh. Then speak to him about it, because we're not getting anywhere. No, we're not. She always like this? Yes. No. Alright, good to know. No? That's a surprise. Maybe it's just Vezrin that does it to her. <clears throat> she's worried. She won't admit it, but she's worried. Hmm. She sees herself as a liability and she's scared that she's gonna get people killed down there. That's all. Ah. <sighs> I wish she would communicate these things to me. It's Sarah. She won't tell you that. She needs the Eclerium. I can't read her <clears> mind. <throat> I know, I know. But why does she need the Eclerium? It's not for me to say exactly why, but it should help with her... ...problems. <sighs> All right. How's it going, lad? <coughs> we'll patch it up a little later when everyone's cooled down a bit. Huh? It's definitely smarter that you all work together. <laughs> I'm worried of her doing something reckless. <laughs> her back's to the wall on this verse. All of our backs are to the wall. 
It's the time I'm we should not. all be working together. <laughs> yes, it is, Markle. The hell's my back to the wall? You're actively being looked for, hunted, searched for, being monitored as we speak, waiting to be... Ah, uh, but here's the thing. I could just disappear. I know they're looking for me. And I know they won't act on it. I'm not going to ask. <clears throat> Frankly, they're scared of me. Hmm. Gather your resources. I don't know why. Talk to the people you need to talk to. And before we all go down there, before we set off, maybe tomorrow, maybe tonight, we get everyone together in one room and we explain how it's going to work. I won't be available tomorrow. And the day after. <clears throat> Hmm. The day after, yeah, the day after tomorrow, we're actually going. Markle, can I task you with getting people organized, ready? Yeah. What's the list? Tyler, you, me. Tyler's not going. Sarah. Oh, you're not going? Oh, shit. I won't be going down. I'll stay with oh, you. Yeah, All right. So. Me, you, it's the Sarah. list I have so far is uh, L, Jensen, Morden, you, Jensen, Joe, Morden, Bay, Sarah, Tang, Cade, Torty, Aegon, which leaves, I think, one spot. Oh my god, there's so many fucking people. I was thinking this could be like a stealth mission. We're gonna go in there, like, 12 if there's people. things we're down there, in, there's other people fighting. down there, we're, we're not gonna be allowed to sneak in. Yeah. We need combatants that we can trust. You know, I used to do this kind of shit with three people, right? Used to? Yeah. I didn't. Well, what are they now? Do... Oh, good question. Well, one of them's probably dead. And the other one, I have no idea. Some of them might need to come. And it's another one of those situations that, you know, I've, Absolutely I've not. This, but, like, whatever I is this kind of thing. Whatever it is that's whispering to him, clearly wants him to go down there. Mm-hmm. You need medical, at least. We have Venora. That's a risk, putting her down there. Really is. She... has volunteered herself. I know it's a risk. Not much we can do about it. We can't take Selma. Well, you have a free spot. Did you say Morden already? Yep. We might be able to take him, but he might need to be a topside to control his men to help on keep <clears throat> the area secure. <sighs> I can go around and ask, talk to- I, I, I let Cade know that you were looking for him, at least. I can- Aegon's gonna want to be paid. Um... Leave the slot open for now. I guess- Feel like someone- someone probably let... If something pops up. Hmm? Sure. Ah. <sighs> <sighs> Right. Thank you guys. Um, find me if you need me. I'll be around. Sure, I'll take care. <clears throat> I've had visions with these people before, you know that, right? I don't want to lead my friends into a death trap again, Marco. Oh. Well, I got my adventuring pass, you know? Yeah, it's a situation, I guess. <sighs> that was just an asshole move. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, I, I was doing the hand on hip because you were doing the hand on hip, but then you waved and I. 
you know, I for like a split second I was gonna offer you a high five, and then I realized how bad it would be. You know. <clears throat> and I'm not looking for you. How can I help? Well, how I need you to speak to my associate Arbaja. Oh. He has some very important info for you. Take me to him. Guess we move to the side first. Thank you. What's going on? There's a girl, a new Mephi. Her father was taken during the attack. Abaja! Is that Ruster I hear? Oh, you're always so yes. loud. Yes. Oh, I'm wearing my fight. Yes, I have some pressing news for you, if we could go somewhere private. Of course. Good to see you again, by the way. Good to see you. I'm not asking that you give me all of that money. Do you know where your father is? Not at the moment. He might be at the keep, or he might be inside. I haven't seen him today. That is what I'm worried about. Oh, hello again. Hello. Father can't help me. They can't help me. My friend won't. Hmm. Nice house you got here. Right. I have some difficult news. Hopefully it's not too late uh, if you do not know where your father is. There are a few people up at the castle in the keep, nobles of high stature, that do not approve of his liking there. I've uh, heard word that a lot of them are probably plotting some sort of plot against you, mostly him. And I was going to advise you to keep an eye on people who come and go, where he frequents specifically going to noble get-togethers. <clears throat> Could be very names. dangerous in the coming days. I don't have names, just well-known rumors. My sources are very well trusted. I'll let them know. Thanks for informing me. Hmm. Of course. Trying to make sure that that gets through. <clears throat> One more thing. All I know is that they are quite invested in the local businesses and economics. So, if that narrows it down any, it should give you a little information. Thanks for the heads up. I'll let him know. You need me? You know where to find me. Of course. This is my cook, by the way. Maeve. And you Pleasure. know Ruster. We'll be around town more often. Good. See you later. Oh, well, since your father helped us, uh, I've currently applied to the mercenary, so if you ever need a swinging arm, let me know. Will do.
What's the honor? Neither they looking at you. No, they're not. I love that face. <clears throat> he doesn't fucking need me. For I am moment. not a good influence on him. For one moment, my dear. Please listen. sure by the end of this you will be far wiser than I you will see things I can only imagine but for now let an old man rant a bit that is why I came you are valued by those around you whether it's hard to understand or hard to see my son if you had but asked Without me being involved, would come down there to ensure. <clears throat> uh, what you need. Not interrupting, am I? I can step away if you. No, you're not. There is something that I want you to do to yourself, Seraveth. I know that we have had our confrontations. You and many people have had confrontations. But at the base of a lot of it, the reflections of your own that I have witnessed has always been you throwing yourself by the wayside. Saying out loud that whatever happens to you will happen, but it doesn't matter because you don't matter. There is a strange self-hatred there. I don't know if it's because life has been unfair. I don't know if it's because you have been downtrodden because of the world around you. But that is not how you have to live your life. You don't deserve that. There's a reason why some people around you will bleed for you will allow the ones they love to go with you. Your life has been hard. But a lot of these places we would not have made it out if it was not for you. Regardless of who remembered to thank you or whether you cared if they did. a solution even if it is risky and dangerous you have to reach out and take it you must <clears throat> you cannot spend the rest of your life consigning yourself to the whims of strangers who promise that they can help <clears throat> you we know that there's an assembly chamber down there, whatever that means to Warforged. If there's an assembly chamber, and they were putting Warforged together, there's star metal, there's a clarion. We've been in these places before, there are things forgotten laying all about. If there is a chance to grab what you need to avoid being beholden to anyone else, <clears throat> you must take it. You've only recently got off the chains, regardless of what they meant or not. Metaphorical, physical. Funny, isn't it? I wouldn't call it funny. Unfair, perhaps. But you have the difference between most people. Mm -hmm. And that is, if you set your mind to it, you can reach out and take that change mm. oh, covered in blood as it might be <sighs> do not let this slip by don't do not another man like Folgrith will come along and you will be so what miserable and dejected by them happen? I don't believe that I was under control I, I was Fine, I was fed and clean and I 
was not suffering. Not in this way. The same, I need someone's Seraphim. guidance. He said I can't the handle this by myself. Is ignorance is bliss. If we are unaware of the pains of the path that we must toil, we suffer less. Wisdom and intelligence is a curse. Because you know what burden you will bear upon your shoulders. It is overwhelming at times. If you think I have not leaned upon my son with tears in my eyes over the probabilities of what may happen to us all, then you do not know me. I am not invincible. You are not invincible. Sometimes you must lean to stay standing. But that doesn't mean you need to topple over for another. I don't want to... I don't want to fuck this up, for me or for anyone. You didn't see it. I can't control anything anymore, except my aim. <laughs> That's the only thing I've ever been able to control. I can't be around the others. Have you? If I go down, I need to go separately with Tang. No one else. You won't make it. We can it. take... We have to try. I cannot do... I cannot go through what happened in Corano again. I can't. I can't even fucking scale a wall properly anymore, On. The moment I lose my composure, the moment it slips, the moment I think about your son and his safety, I lose it. Something happens every fucking time. I can't take it anymore. Tang can withstand whatever it is that's happening to me. I know he can. I can't do it. If the source is down there, who knows what happens the closer I get. What if you carried Mirandel's rock? He plans to bring Torty. I will not put I her in I told him that's a... B Please speak sense to that man. He was The sort of things that we saw down there. He's already creating the entire plan himself. <clears throat> so, it's whatever. I would prefer to work I, on my own. I trust him to keep the others in line. So do I. But... I need, him, I need someone there to counterbalance that. I... I am not a leader. I'm not asking you to be a leader. We butt heads too <sighs> much. It is not good. There will be no synergy. The only person that I can think of... that would be able to weather... Vesrin's antics is your son. I don't know if they will survive without both of your help. I don't know if they'll make it. I think they're all going to die. They cannot see in the dark. They None don't of them know should be fucking going there. down there. None need of them. A I don't care. Force. If there are elves that are trained for this, we need everyone who can fight. I would go myself if I was not here with responsibilities to these people. Mm. It'd be so much easier if it was just Tang and I. He has no flesh, and I am not a loss if I go missing. But they have reasons to go down. Well, that's the fuck all of it. Each of them are very important reasons to go down, and it pisses me off. And you don't think having a chance to contain what plagues you is important? There are other ways. 
enslaving myself to the dwarven holds, maybe. Or leaving. Why are you so Which set I don't want on to your do. own destruction? Because that's all I do. It's all I've ever known is destruction. Everything I fucking touch rots or burns or explodes. Friendships, people, things. Silver. I just can't do it anymore. I can't. I'm so tired. Please. is a heavy burden. I cannot begin to fathom what you are feeling and not having that kind of control. But I do know about you is that every time that I've seen another try to enforce their will, any of our enemies have tried to force something upon us, your friends, or you, you have always vied against it. I've never seen you lay down and die. I but that is what this to. would be doing. That is what this would be doing. You even said it would get worse. We cannot allow that. You must retrieve this Eclarion. Then we can start forging our way towards a solution. Work around whoever it is that purports to be the sole opinion of what to be done with you. You cannot be the only one. If there's information about it, and they know this, and they know what you are, then there's been a study. Whether the Institute has information or someone else. The only other option is they are completely lying to your face. So either there is more information upon it, and we can derive another way, or they're full of shit. And to allow yourself to degrade over this would probably be your greatest failure. And you don't strike me as a kind of person to allow something like that to mar your future. No. I don't know. I just don't know. It's not easy. The choice that you have to try and make, it is difficult. And sometimes, some problems are so oppressive and make it so hard to breathe. Our chests will feel so tight. And we will fear what the outcome will be. If I do this, will I get everyone killed? If I don't act, will it be worse? And those of us who are blessed or cursed, that sort of thinking and insight will throw these would-bes and could-bes around in our heads until we feel like we've run a hundred miles. At the end of the day, no one else is going to make these opportunities for you. Even the man who purports to have the answer still sending you to get it done. You have to do this yourself with your allies and your friends. And you need to weather whatever it is that happens Whatever the side effect might be, because it will only get worse. You have a chance, a window, right now, to take a risk and contain it or fix it. Or forever allow it to chain you and subjugate you. You can't even trust yourself or your own body. I don't think you need nor deserve that. Even 
Even if we do make it down there and I get my hands on that metal. If even one of the people that I have grown to care about dies or gets injured beyond repair, the life will not be worth living anymore. It is unfair to save yourself and setting yourself up for failure. I told Merendel that he needs to do that. That we have two days until the Radad men are spread so thin that I will not be able to station any men at the entrance to that ruin. And if you are pursued by drow, if you are pursued by elves or anything else, You'll be hit from behind. I won't be able to help you. Two days is pushing it. On that second day, I'll be bringing a contingent of Radard soldiers I trust and heavy plate and crossbows and going myself so I can command them to ensure that no elves come across the border and try to flood their way in. And we will wait until you come back. People are too good for me. I think you're too unkind to yourself. If I believed even a fraction of what you're saying, then our encounter by the lake would have been very different. I am glad you are alive. I must make my way to the keep. <clears throat> Real quick, before you go. Unfortunately, make it very quick, my son. Abaja just mentioned that a few of the lords are kind of fed up with you and me and plotting to do something about it. If Mamalorian takes priority, just be careful while you're up there. Apparently, take chances. someone related to uh, coin or investments or whatever. Just be careful. I would be grateful if you could get your hand on perhaps an antidote of a stronger variety, just in case. <laughs> I'll go talk to Venora. I love you, my son. And you. Do you want me down there? I... Look after your allies. Yeah. You understand why I did what I did to Vesran? Why I spoke to him the way oh, I did? Uh, hold on. I, I can hazard a guess. Livery. Eleven silver, seventy copper. Blink. For what? I don't need uh, any of them from the treasure about me. that we sold that was in your house for so fucking long. I want them to that's not your care. portion of it. Oh, oh. I want them to prioritize their own needs. You, you don't want it? <clears throat> my life doesn't revolve around silver, do I? I know, but... I worry by doing this, you're hamstringing yourself. And by the way, thank you for saving me. Get I'm something already nice. hamstringed, Kyla. <clears throat> so don't make it worse. I've been hamstringed well, since birth. I mean, well, that, that's kind of the first portion of it, but also... None of them can help me. me. I figured should also get a portion None of, of them. It, you know? Not one person that he named can help me. You... Will barely be able to help me. I told him, and he was like, "I'm a danger to you." So I mean, like, even standing this close to you, I. I'm gonna be honest with you. You're probably not going to like. I don't feel in danger. Oh well, most people have been giving their portion anyway. So. That doesn't change anything. That makes it worse. You should be scared. Why are you not scared? I'm scared. 
they snatch him up, he does the able pay him rock. <sighs> yeah, okay. You okay? Yeah. If something happens to you. Are you? I know. I heard a lot of muttering, but I couldn't make out anything, but it sounded important. Kylie. <laughs> Your pain is mine. If I lose you, if I take something from you, like a limb, or your sight, if I mar your face, I will never forgive myself. I will never be able to go on the same. I can't go through it again. <clears throat> Going down there is your best bet on getting a control of this. Having your allies help you is your best bet of doing that successfully. And once that's done, once you get what you need, it'll be okay. You'll have what you need. We don't know that. We don't know. The it's the bracelets are a dream. Our best bet, though. Afraid even when fighting. What else can we do but step even forward? Even if we get this metal. Even if we get this metal. These things will not stand. We still have to forge it. One step at a time. Your father read me like a book. He's good at that. Okay. I'll uh, keep that in mind. I wasn't going down there for star metal. Kyla. I feel like I'm undermining him. It's not my intent, but just... If but now I have to. Going to be involved in something, then you need to know what it is. I yeah, no, I appreciate the warning, for sure, because, like, I, I didn't know anything was going Your on Your pain is all. my pain, Sarah. I wanted to. As you said. <laughs> if you intended to go down there and not come back. I think back. you're entitled to... Can you do me a favor? Always. That's why I wanted to go alone. You know, I'd have to come after you, right? Decently strong antidote. You would not. Seems I've been told that you wouldn't make it halfway. You wouldn't be able to stop me. And you'd be stupid for trying. Uh, do you need one right now? I would and you'd do the same for me. Of course I would. Tit for tat. I can spit fire out of my fucking wrists. It's pretty fucking cool. Do you want me to tell her the whole, tell her the whole thing? No, it's no? not. Not when it singes your fucking eyelashes off. It's not cool. Now we're getting along anyway. I'm fine. I'm okay. Oh, Captain, sure. but you Don't say that. You're welcome, Captain. Just... I need to go apologize to Vesseran before it's too late. I really dislike fighting with him. Do you want me to come with you? If you'd like to witness me roll over like a dog and say Let's that I'm go. going to listen to his every whim... Come on, you. Oh. <laughs> It'll be all right. You One day I hope I can me. enjoy those hugs again. And I'll be there. Okay? You want me down there, I'll go. You want me up top, I'll stay up top. There are two people who can decide that for me. Him and you. Okay. Come on. Oh, I fucking hate emotions. I wish I didn't have any. I was talking to Elena today. 
So did I. I enjoy her. She, she said the same about you. Uh, speaking of not enjoying Hello, someone. Little drow. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm kidding. How are you, Torty? Well, doing all right. Only got called a, a curse like once by some lady, so you know, all right. Fuck her. Exactly. Cabbage curses heard. Those they tell them. Big curse is cool. It's on trend right now. News to me, but I. We're on our buddies. What's your curse? Wait. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> I'm sure you'll find out. We're on our way to Vesrin. We're about to go oh, talk to Vesrin. Okay. Right. Okay. Sure. You wanna come along? I'm going to go apologize to him. It might be a spectacle. Wait, what? why do you have to apologize to him? What do you, what do, you do? I attacked him verbally. Oh. Oh. I'm sure I he's used to it by now. a hard time responding to stressful situations in a proper manner. That's fair. Alright. Uh, this way. Vez. Vez. Yes. Uh, this way. There we go. Ah. Hello, Tori. Hello, Sarah. Hello. Can we talk? All right. Should we go inside again? Let's talk. If that's all right. Come along. Don't want to bother your father. Oh wait, no, he left. He's Come back on. at the keep. Probably getting shanked. Hope he's all right. <sighs> yeah, me too. By the way, Tordy, you think you have a leather back? Actually, wait, I started on one earlier. You're very lucky. I'll be ready tomorrow. Good. I will start by apologizing for my misconduct earlier. I was not prepared for multiple people that I care about to be going down there, and I was under the impression that it would just be myself and Tang for a very specific reason. Mm. After speaking to Arnolf, I've decided it's wise if I go down with the rest of you and listen to your every whim, if you'll have me. Of course I'll have you. Right then. Thanks. In fact, I'm hoping I can rely on you. To see things I can't. Don't get ahead of yourself. I don't even know how to fucking say this without... This affliction, it's getting worse. I cannot be relied upon in combat. I cannot be relied upon in any fashion. Stealth. Ranged. Every time I lose my composure, every time I think about anything else other than what I'm doing, anytime I slip away, daydream, Something happens. It's nearly killed Torty. And 
It's nearly killed Kyla. I've nearly lost limbs. I've teleported right before your eyes. It's getting worse, mm. and I can't control it. And that is why this I do not material. want to with you. It will help you, right? I once again have to return to shackles, but yes. It will help me oh, internalize the problems. It will remove the threat from others. I will have to weather the storm inside. It will take time and practice, but... It's a step in the right direction. Then we'll find this metal. It will be protected. You can stand with Markle. Keep him appraised of situations. He'll be mapping out the cave so that we don't get lost. You can be a spotter. I don't like fighting with you. And I'm sorry that I have a hard time communicating things. I'm just really scared. A life without any of you is no life. I feel the same. To be honest, I'm shook into my core. Every time we have to go down into one of these places. But I'm glad you'll be there with me. Truly. I'll try my best not to set you on fire. If you want to set anyone on fire, set me on fire. I'm the only one with the magic rock. <laughs> I see. You're always the one with the <laughs> magic rock, Vez. Not all the time. <clears throat> Sometimes it's Torty. When you're free later, I need to talk to you. Hi, I'm Torty. <laughs> sure. Maybe we get everyone magic rocks. Speaking of Torty, um... <sighs> it'd be very useful to have more eyes that can see in the dark down there. Not a but good idea. But if you did want to go down there, it's, um... Very, very dangerous, and there will probably be horrible things that you've never seen before. And there's a high likelihood that some of us are gravely injured, if not worse. So, all that laid out, if you don't want to go, oh. I'll not... You're, as well as you are selling that, first of all, A plus. Um, Tazim also or Arn also had a good point. I'm kind of <sighs> chicken shit when it uh, comes to things that I don't know what the fuck they are. Like in Corano, I almost died. Um. Like, really bad. And I, you say things, he says monsters, what are we expecting down there? I don't know. Magic. That's what we're expecting. And if it's mm. untapped, unregulated, that means it's probably warped whatever's down there. <clears throat> Arn did say, and I quote, Upon hearing that you intended to take Torty, please talk some sense into the man. I intended to. She may be able to see in the dark, invite, but she but does not she... wander the dark. It's not. Wise. I'm not sneaky. Uh, anything that I can see in the night, it can fucking hear me. I learned that from all of my attempts of trying to sneak around with him. I, I almost got the both of it's us really killed. Bad. I'm sorry. It's like walking through right. pets and pens right. that are like dried leaves. It's disgusting, actually. Honestly, I'm... I vomit it, when I think about it too horrible. much. Like, oh, it actually fine. makes me vomit no. a little bit no, in my mouth. I'm, I'm relieved. <laughs> I'm relieved that you won't be going. <sighs> really? Well, yes, but not because 
of what they said. Um, never mind. Um, what were we? Oh, sorry. Stop it. Sorry. <clears throat> Um, yeah, I'm right, more so, of a detriment uh, if you bring me, so for your own sake, I'll stand out. Maybe she can fight alongside Arnolf on the surface. There. And be a part of the that sounds that like can I come can down do. with Kyla. Very well. Yeah. to both worlds. All right, then. You'll be with me. That you'll have to speak to Arnolf about, though. Candles. If I end up staying there and not going down, all right. I still don't know what he wants me to do with that. I'll leave a spot open just in case. What would you have me do? I haven't made up my mind yet. Let me know. Mm. Right, Yay, then. team! Um, Go yes. Team <laughs> That's right, I forget. Right. I'll um go and talk to the others, see if we can get a whole group together. Otherwise we'll be going down short handed. Um bring as much food as you can if <clears throat> I don't know, one or two days worth of rations. I'll do my best to offset it. I definitely hurt his feelings with the kissing joke. I totally forgot. Yeah, to, uh... you, did you not know we were broken up? I forgot. Oh. For like a split mm. second. What yeah. happened? His... His... <sighs> he has to make good with his uncle, who's, you know, a war hero at Kellyn Drow. That doesn't mean you guys can't kill... Can't, can't... <sighs> wow. That doesn't mean you guys can't still kiss, right? I mean... No one has to see it. Oh, it's just one of those things that, that I... Better if we're together, I don't want to pretend that we're not. I And also, he says like, oh, maybe I'm going to be a noble and maybe I can change policies and blah, blah, blah. I'm like, okay, Vezern, you are enough. That's going to be in like 50 years. So, yeah. Well, welcome back I mean, to single squad. the time in the world. We all do. <laughs> yeah. yeah. All the drow are single. <laughs> all the drow are single. I'll need to ask we Tiberius. Have relationship trauma. He is. Oh yeah, he's he single. single. He's been flirting like Of course crazy you two already Basil, fucking know so that. So there's a chance that he's not going to be Yeah. Well, I listen. He's I'm like, "Oh, fuck. tell me about his he... order." Hmm, I wonder where he comes from. You guys like, "Is he single?" No, I, I'm pissed off at him because he's flirting with Basil. <clears throat> That's why I know. I mean, Basil's a bathhouse girl. Like everyone flirts with her. She's That's not a bathhouse girl anymore, and also engaged to Soma, who sucks at flirting with his wife. So I had to fucking tell him that I slept with his wife, so he'd actually step up. <gasps> it's so annoying. You're a real hero. Yeah. Oh my goodness. It worked. Mm -hmm. He fucking used her like a here. pillow, just like I told him to. Oh. She was happy in the next morning. <laughs> I need to find Venora. I need to get on a anti-poison. What the fuck is happening? <laughs> I also need to find Venora. Wait, I thought that was Venora? my job. Did he also tell you? He told me yeah. to do it, but if he told, we can go together. How did you do that? Okay. Do what? You like did yeah, just pop up. <laughs> I can't move like that anymore, my old granny bones. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Did you just, sure that was did a you lot just more impressive, but your hip killed you. I... Are you tiptoes? Is that what you did? Yeah. How the fuck? Ow! You can't do that? I got my nails done, so I can't do that. No. <gasps> I, thought... I can't squat! I can do it! <gasps> I did it! <clears throat> I can do it now. This hurts my knees so bad. Oh. Specifa. 
and remember how I couldn't do it earlier and then I complained and then mm -hmm. even Arn did it and I got pissed off? <laughs> and then you go. Why are you hopping? <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Let's go find Venora. You're all weird. <laughs> okay. What the f- <laughs> You did it first! I was cracking my knees. <laughs> I thought you got to do it. <sighs> Should I go flirt with Basil? Where's Basil? E I could do it right now. <laughs> Should we all go and start flirting with Basil later. in front of fucking so much? Yes. Oh, no. Please, 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 please. Everyone just talk over each other. It gets super fucking incoherent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. It's gonna be perfect. Hello, Basil. Hey, Basil. You're, you're looking like great like today. So I really like how the your sun shines through so your hair. Very, so nice, very nice, very lovely. I think, and I, I love the little tattoos. <laughs> yeah, I love how you do your eyes. makeup. And so yes, I hate that what, you hide what your shade freckles. Of lipstick is that? <laughs> I remember told you you're like the perfect height, like girlfriend height. <laughs> mm hmm. Yeah, your outfit is you're right you're right this outfit just doesn't suit you it's better on the floor oh my god true wow. <laughs> you know last night i slept in your old room and it reminded me of evil. all those wonderful times we had together uh -huh. <laughs> that's a lot come on nights. man what are you fucking sitting there mm, watching so punch one of us in the face do something <laughs> do <laughs> something <laughs> Just hit me! Just hit, me. Just hit, me. Just hit, hit me or I'm gonna fuck your you, girlfriend! You. Hit me! What? <laughs> hit me right now! He's not hitting you. Fuck me or I'll hit your girlfriend. <laughs> you free tonight? Wait, no. She, uh, she's huh? gonna be free you pretty late. What? No. <laughs> Wait a minute. I'm fucking... Wait a minute. Hold on. What? <laughs> what the fuck? Wait, 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 right wait. Here. Wait a minute. <laughs> God, God! Oh my God, he's no. so manly. Totally wow, you. he's, he's so totally manly. Oh. He defended your honor, Miss <laughs> Basil. Oh, you so defended. Cool. What that is happening? <laughs> Congratulations, you hit a woman somewhere. <laughs> you I think I know defended her <laughs> honor. She took my hand. She took my fucking. So, I can't so you. Don't treat her it's like that. What is it? She likes it, but you know, to ask no. first, you know. Yeah. What is happening? <laughs> All right. Hey. This, this is, this is everything. This, this has brought such a smile to my face. Do this more often. This was wonderful. Why? Please. Why, why were you going for it? Queen, I still love you. This day. Need something? Why? Yes, I need something. I, I have I've... some supplies <clears throat> to make this. Oh, okay. Yeah, I need them. I love you worked with. Every single moment of that. I love okay. you too. Uh, step into my office. If, if you would. I mean, yes. I, mean, I will step into your office. I, mean, oh. I need a. I need a fix. Tang's nub. I'm fixing Tang's nub. He's working on my arm. <clears throat> All right, so what's the, what are we fixing it now, or what are we? <clears throat> it'll, uh, it'll take two seconds. Get your hand off his seconds. nuts! <laughs> Wait. What? Do you even have nuts? Why does everybody ask you me that? You think you see, you think you see <laughs> one sticking out of his shoulder. He's got a sneaky nut. What? Wait. <laughs> what, uh, what do you need, Tang? How can I help, buddy? He definitely has some jewels. Like, I seen that. Hmm. You know, in in. Two seconds, just okay. yeah. two seconds, just. Mm. No. Okay, bye. I'll be right out. The house we go. And then and then and I mean, then. You can. You can hear this if no. you want. It's not really. No. Mm. Too late. We're out here. Okay then. Oh man, we're gonna have some such good secret Get conversations. So. 
I have an idea of how to put my arm back together in the time frame that we need. Okay. Uh, but there's there's one problem. Okay. Technically two problems. Okay, okay. <laughs> he pulls out a steel ingot that has an imperial signia on the ingot. Okay. I can burn that off. Yeah. I bought that from Markle. I don't know if he actually bought it from the Imperium. <sighs> yes, he is. I don't know if they sell their shit. Sold me some stuff as well. <clears throat> okay. Another well, problem? I got two ingots of steel. Okay. The, the other problem is they need to work on it. So, whatever parts we make from that need to be made before we hand them to them. Them being the Imperials. Yes. Okay, so what do you want me to do with him? Barring Ziegler, wherever he may be. We follow the schematics for my old arm, using those ingots. <clears throat> the precision things will need to be overseen by an engineer. They're not sequestered to the ships, to my knowledge, but... <clears throat> they at least will be able to put together the arm and install it properly. All we need to do is make sure that those symbols are not on the ingots, so that they're able to work however they may need to. Okay. By the time they get here. I... have... okay. Yeah, I'll reforge them. I'll just melt them down and then recast them. Should be easy. Okay. Good. And we have... We have two days. Counting today. <clears throat> okay. Before we go, right? Uh, yes. Okay, so however long it takes to make this, it's either we start it today or we finish it in the next day. Otherwise, I'm not going to have an arm. Yep. Luckily, <laughs> he pulls out an already made steel hand. <laughs> we got this. So, half the work done. That's handy. Okay. I think. We just need to readjust the gears and things on it to be able to be integrated with the arm <laughs> itself. The schematics should be able to accommodate for that, but a few things may need to be tweaked. Anyway. <clears throat> <clears throat> yeah. You want to start this today? Biggest problem, insignia. At the very least, getting the insignia and out. Uh, I'll handle the insignias, and then tomorrow, once... You know, it all rolls over, we'll do your arm. How about that? Yeah. Alright. <clears throat> Get the parts prepared today. Those things fucked out of the way. Got it. Any precision making can be done tomorrow and assembly can done that can be done after they're completed. Okay. I'll get those most Hopefully, done and do the we have main enough. parts and then tomorrow we can Yeah. Yeah. Fantastic. <sighs> Where the fuck did they go? Oh. Okay. Vera, he's out. What are you doing? Uh, we're trying to see Akka. They're hiding in bushes. What the fuck is an Akka? I'm gonna be away from that. Uh, it's the the feral fish person that destroyed somebody earlier. Okay. 